Hey guys, this is Andy Chatfield from PTC Optics. I'm uh, just here today to show you um, setting up a session in my TriCaster Mini um, using a NTSC 1080i session, which I think is the most common in the TriCaster. The last video I did I showed using a PAL, which a PAL session, which is how our cameras will natively get pulled into the TriCaster Mini. But um, for this test, I'm going to be using uh, an MDHX decimator cross converter to bring my my frame rate for my camera, which is the PTZ Optics camera, would be 1080p 30. I am going to convert that to 1080p 2997 and bring it into the TriCaster. I've already set up my decimator. I did that in a previous video. Um, I'm just going to do a new session here. Just, we'll do NTSC 1080i. And we are going to. Did you keep a bottle of scotch in your desk? No. So there you go. That is my. Uh, that is my camera. I just have it set on auto detect, and it's pulling in 1080p 30, no problem. Um, I'm just going to real quick. I do have control set up here, so I'm just going to do that again. That is the decimator, that's the cross converter that's on my video screen that I'm using to bring in a um, 2997 frame rate to the TriCaster, which is what it's looking for. Um, I want to mention the cross converter isn't needed except for the TriCaster minis. Um, our cameras have been tested with the 410, the 460, the 860, and the 8000, and they pull in fine at a 1080p 30 session in there, or a 1080i session. Um, but for the minis, you do need to use a cross converter. So I should become one. Turn on PTZ. There we go. I'm going to go down PTZ here. Move my camera around a little bit. Back of that cross converter. go. That's one. This one's somewhere else. Play my mess of a desk. So, yeah. That is pulling the PTZ Optics into a NTSC session, 1080i. You can do 1080p or any other uh, resolution as well. And the camera will pull through perfectly using the Decimator MDHX. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. I will see you later.